So, for the ingredients, you're only going to need three things. One and a half pounds of boneless chicken thighs, three teaspoons of Bush of Brownies authentic jerk sauce, and roughly half a cup of cornstarch, but we'll have to figure out the exact amount when you're mixing. Here you can see one and a half pounds of boneless chicken thighs. I've diced the chicken thighs into about one inch cubes, making sure to not make them too thick. Here you can see the jerk seasoning. This can be purchased on Amazon as either a single or a six pack. Here we see three dollops of jerk sauce. This is about three teaspoons. Using your hands, mix the chicken with the sauce, making sure to get full coverage on every piece. Now, add in your cornstarch slowly and mix thoroughly, although once totally mixed, don't mix too much. This is about the consistency you want, a chalky, slight look over the whole thing, and very, very tiny little particles of cornstarch. Here's a close-up on a single piece of chicken. It is a messy process, so that's why I prefer to wear gloves. So here I have my fryer set to 375. You can also do this in a skillet over the stove. If you're gonna do it that way, make sure you heat your oil until a very faint smoke comes off the top and you know you're to temperature. Now I've got the chicken in the fryer. Be sure to make sure that the chicken is fully submerged and that you don't overfill your fryer basket. Here, I've closed the lid of the fryer. Obviously, if you're doing this on a skillet, you don't really need to cover it. Once the chicken reaches a nice golden brown cover, quickly remove it. You don't want to overcook it. Shake off the excess oil and put your chicken into a nice serving dish. This chicken goes absolutely amazing with Tabasco sauce, so that's always my favorite and my go-to with this dish. Tabasco, a nice bowl of rice. This is a delicious, easy, quick, and wholesome meal. And also IBS friendly.